you know, every game is different. Every every day is different when it comes to just life in general. So I mean, it, it's not like these ki these types of performances weren't in me last year. It's just you know, a lot has to happen. Like Coach Rick's been saying, I mean, for the O line to do their job the way they did it and kind of dominate the line of scrimmage, and for there not to be just a drop, you know, I mean, a lot of stuff has to happen. This isn't like I did something, you know, spectacular. I mean, the whole offense did something spectacular um, that game that, you know, just doesn't really always happen. And so it's just, it was a full offensive effort to get that stat. Did you happen to hear from the two guys that had the record before you? No, I haven't. No, the one with the Jets, one with the coaching. Yeah, I haven't heard. You know, it, it didn't make a big deal in the game, but you know, one pass that, that doesn't get mentioned, hadn't been mentioned by Coach Rick, Coach Rick or Coach or you, is has been uh, Michael Chigbu's catch that kind of saved the mm -hmm. saved the streak for you there at the end. I mean, kind of what happened on that play? You seemed like you weren't very happy about what happened. Yeah, I was upset just because I, I missed him, and I feel like if I hit him in stride, he would be able to run and get at least four more yards for the first down. Um, and so I was definitely upset with myself over that one. Um, but yeah, he had to make a sliding catch. Um, I think he, we got nine when we needed 13 or 14, and so um, that one was on me. That was, uh, was definitely a minus on the road for that one. Grayson, I guess Auburn and South Carolina switched quarterbacks today, benched their starters and really? put in new ones. Does it surprise you? Is that part of it? Do you ever? It just happened to me. <laughs> <laughs> I, I've been through it, you know, and it's uh, every day, you know, grind to, to hold that to hold that spot and uh, you're fighting for your job every day no matter what kind of game you have it all can change in a heartbeat um, so like I said you just got to take every day one day at a time is that in the back of your mind I mean you've got you've got a game plan each week you've got to carry out you've got film study does it is that just something that stays in the in the way back that that could happen um I mean I guess as a competitor you're more thinking about you know beating yourself um, more than anybody else because I feel like if I'm, if I'm constantly beating myself and, and getting better each day and bettering the day that I had before that, that's really what I really need to focus on, other than not really like what everybody else is doing. Um, but definitely, you know, as a competitor, you, you want to be the guy out there on the field. And, and so I wouldn't say it's in the back of my mind because you're preparing for the other opponent um, or the opponent that you're about to face. But, but yeah, you always know that you're, you're competing for a job.